Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Get Familiar With. Today I will show you the Autocon 3rd 400. Uh, this is the latest version of the electrical generator from Cal Storz. You see here the machine together with the two different sets of pedals. The classic one uh, with the cut and coagulation. Cut is yellow, internationally yellow and blue its coagulation and the single one can uh, uh, be used only for um, the coagulation. So uh, these two pedals can be connected simultaneously on the rear part of the machine as I will show you later. And now I show to you the uh, rear side of the Autocon uh, 3 400. Uh, it's characterized by the uh, electrical plug here the main uh, switch for the electricity uh, because the frontal switch it's only standby and the two connectors for the for the pedals remember we have the uh, um, cut and coagulation pedal the double one and the single one only for coagulation so we can um, have both of them connected to the machine in order to uh, be ut utilized at the same time in the lower part, we have a RS232. It's a serial connector, used only for internal user. Um, the uh, network plug over here, and the USB. Laterally, the two SB connectors, but they are designed in a different way from the SB you uh, probably know very well from the EC pump. So this is the posterior rear panel uh, of the uh, Autocon 400. Let's start now to work with the Autocon 3rd. Uh, um, first of all, uh, we switch on the machine. This is only, remember, a standby uh, button. The main uh, electrical uh, uh, connectors on the rear side of the machine. It takes a few seconds. There is a nice music at the beginning, introducing the logo of the company and therefore the main uh, screen. You see, when everything is ready, we get the connectors activated. So you see, when uh, everything is ready, you get uh, all the uh, lights around the, the connectors here. And these connectors, these socket, are characterized by the fact that when we plug, you see, the light disappear and appears the menu. If you release, the menu remain here except if you plug if you push off and the menu disappear so the machine is divided out of the screen in two main parts this area is the area of the unipolar connectors and this area is the area for the bipolar connection so you can connect simultaneously two unipolar devices and two bipolar devices there are different cables as i will show you later uh, some of them are simple cables uh, uh, released by each company producing instruments uh, to be connected to one of these uh, holes over here. Some others uh, are intelligent connector. It means they have a chip inside and it looks quite different. So the machine recognizes immediately which instrument, uh, even if the instrument itself is not yet connected, which instrument can be used at that moment. Let's have a look now at the main screen that is a touch screen. On the upper part, uh, we uh, see, first of all, a star. The star, if you push star, we have the, pro the favorite uh, program we can choose getting into the menu, as I will show you later. Then uh, we have uh, this symbol that indicates if the neutral plate is connected. This also will be shown later. The lock here, it's open, it means we can modify. If we push, it goes in lock mode and you have to release it. He, uh, high are information. We don't have information at the moment. Any log, any problem up, uh, happens to the machine will be reported here. And finally, the menu. So let's get in, into the menu. The first option are the programs. The programs, uh, are the different options already memorized in the machine um, and we can choose to bring some of them into our favorite program list. 
It's just easy. You push the star with the green arrow and the option gets in. And then we go back to the list of the program and we scroll, we scroll up or down, you see, the uh, different option. And for example, we found some gynecological option, tubal sterilization, conization, etc. Uh, for example, conization. And we choose, oops, conization. And we choose to bring it into our favorite or to remove, you see? Green to insert, uh, uh, red uh, to remove. Okay, once we have decided, then we confirm and we go back to the main uh, menu. You see, if this appears and you don't want to, sh to show on the screen, just click on off and it will disappear. Back to the menu. Favorites. Favorites show to you the same that the stars show you. So the your favorite programs. Okay, there are the standard and the, for example, gynecological conization. Back, system setting. System setting, how to start is nothing else than the automatic mode. When you use, for example, a, a coagulation instruments, as soon as you close the two part of the instruments, the effect starts. Uh, this is, you can regulate with this option, you can uh, regulate the time between the activation of the uh, instrument and the real electrical effect uh, using this scroll bar or the plus and or minus uh, button. Language selection, obviously to choose your language, or our system selection in order to eventually connect the this machine to a so-called OR1 system or other system available in your operatory theater. The brightness of the display and finally to lock the system instead of having the system unlocked. Back to the main menu. We have the volume. With the volume, you regulate the uh, volume of the alarm the key and the activation. So this can be regulated uh, as you prefer. Save program. Save program in order to save uh, with a different name some of your already existing option or a new option you create. Socket configuration. You have to take care of the socket co configuration. Soft, uh, socket extension, uh, you just choose uh, which of the, of the connectors should be available, okay, depending by your cable. But the most complicated is the, to be uh, understood is the zap mode. The zap mode, it's real zapping mode between a socket. So here you decide which of this socket could be zapped in. For example, we choose the first in the uh, um, monopolar and the first in the bipolar. We confirm. Now, as you will see, as soon as we will connect the cable, you will be able to choose two different modality inside one socket. And finally, the last two option, you have the service where you have the possibility to get into the system of the device, but it's reserved to the uh, customer technician, and the system information that tell you which version of the system is available on the machine. And, for, and these are all the menu options. Back you are in the main screen. Thank you.